Hi everyone, I am proper looking forward to this game coming out, Star Wars Outlaws. Cold Stream. The only thing I've seen of this is one gameplay video. Okay, and in that gameplay video, I remember some kind of spaceship flying above and then the character I think shot at it and then robbed it or something. Um, and from what I remember, this, if this is done correctly, which I think it is going to be done correctly, is going to be possibly one of the best games ever. Now, I know that's a massive claim, um, but just the way that that gameplay looked, it appeared to be absolutely mind-blowing. It looked like perfection. It looked amazing. It's open world, it's space, and it's done by Star Wars. So it has to be mental, right? So this is going to be the sci-fi space GTA. Can you imagine? Can you imagine what that's going to be like? And yeah, that's me saying that this is potentially going to be one of the top, top games, right? And games that I rate extremely highly, I mean, we're going to go back now. We're talking Tenchu, the first one, maybe Tenchu 2, but definitely the first one. Metal Gear Solid, the series in general, but the first one, maybe two as well. Um, GTA, of course. Yeah. And for those who know, for those who played Warhawk, Warhawk was absolutely stunning and now it's gone but Warhawk was mind-blowing and let's chuck Ghosts of Tsushima in there as well Ghosts of Tsushima a masterpiece and I think Star Wars Outlaws is going to be the next masterpiece that we're going to see okay so let's have a look at it let's see what's going on I know it's really being released soon this might make me get a PS5. I don't think I'll buy this to play on PC, but it's not impossible. Um, so yeah, hit subscribe. However I, I buy this game and play this game, I will want this to be put online and for you guys to have a look as I go through it because it's going to be stunning. You can just tell. Anyway, let's go over some of the media that came out about this. So we'll have a look at the trailer, which I have not seen. We'll have a look at that gameplay footage again, which I did see, but I didn't watch all of it. I try to avoid trailers where I can, um, just so I get the actual authentic experience when it happens. Okay, but let's do this, guys. Okay, here we go. These are dangerous times. At least that's what I hear. The Empire? They're everywhere. Of course, that's gorgeous, but that's a cutscene, so... But the world here... ...belongs to the Syndicates. This is all cutscene, but, um... ...still gorgeous, isn't it? If I want to survive... This better show gameplay. Looks like I'm all in. She's in here somewhere. On second thought, I'm out. It would be cool if you could play like, like different lifestyles. So like if you could actually train to be a stormtrooper. If you could actually choose a direction like dark side, Jedi, Mandalorian even. my whole life and now I just need a chance to finally be free the environments look great but again this is also a cutscene that looks gorgeous I'm here to offer you a way out okay get off my ship Jalen give me a chance that's beautiful you're gonna have to trust me you'll be dangerous look at that environment 
but if you pull this off, you'll never look over your shoulder again. I think there's no gameplay on this, is there? Beautiful. Stunning, but no gameplay. But it's a big galaxy out there. And I'm gonna risk it all. Yeah, and you guys showed us nothing. Okay, very good. Star Wars Outlaws, coming 2024. 2024. Okay, I'm not happy with that. Okay, very good. Right, guys, let's jump back in. This is gameplay, but I want to see more than this. I want to see the outside world, not just inside and shooting, but let's start here. All right, here we go. Classic Star Wars orchestral music. Does not that is gorgeous if that's not final quality. Look at the state of that glass. These are graphics, man. Can we play as this guy? Good boy. Space cat. I want that fighter stripped for parts by tomorrow. Okay, we're in, we're in, we're in. Okay, looking very nice. Looking very nice at this point. <laughs> stealth. I will take stealth. Thank you very much. Open world with stealth. All right, so far so good. I don't see what the issues are so far. The graphics are beautiful. Very detailed environment. Stunning environment. Very PS5. Oh, that's interesting. This is a bit Rainbow Six, isn't it? This is what Rainbow Six... Okay, because that's your pet. Right, okay, okay, okay. Pet controls. Nice one. I'm loving it already. Hang on tight, little buddy. No, no. That drop could have been a little bit better. Spotted. Oh no, mate. Beautiful. Okay, okay, we'll figure this out. Those shots were nice. Okay, it looks a little bit rigid when it comes to this camera movement and this running. It could look a bit more cinematic. That was very nice though. Like, it's not giving me urgency here. Like, for example, Metal Gear Solid would. But this is an open world game, so it's going to behave differently. That was nice. This is getting bad. The blasters look beautiful, don't they? Those those bullets, those shots, they look gorgeous. Let's try this out. The sparks are nice. That explosion was very nice. Dick Ferrick! Actually in, in the in the shooting the camera movement is very good. Wow. Got some gadgets too. I think that went pretty well, right? Okay, vehicle. Bit of driving. Look at how nice and wide that is. Oh, these guys are quick. This is brilliant. Hang on. Brilliant. Oh, nice. We've got slow mo as well. That was close. Andy Five, I got the package. Where are you? Waiting for you in Jonta's Hope. Were you seen? I said I got it. What else matters? Should I assume we won't be working for the Pikes anytime soon? Um, well. This is a really nice environment. 
So this is a little bit Red Dead, isn't it? Red Dead Redemption, but like, out there in space. I wonder what a city looks like. I bet they're stunning. I think I'm going to have to get this game. This looks amazing already. I'm very happy with this at this point. Is this the bar that we just saw in that previous video? No, looks like it, but it's not. Hey, Andy. Huh? You're late, Kay. Doc is waiting. What? Are you worried? No. Okay. No, but the droid. What? Not the droid. Be careful. Donka's a broker, not a friend. She can't be trusted. Who can out here? See you back at the ship. Yeah, see you back at the ship, mate. We love a hologram, don't we, guys? We love a hologram. Kvass. Back already. I told you she's fresh, but she's good. Who's this? Just a friend. Oh, somebody from the Empire. First Order. Job was more complicated than you said, Danka. You lived. <laughs> hey, he's on toys. What's that? Don't eat it. She's taking it. A bit of cash, is it? Wait. We haven't met. Don't really know many of you. Stealing illegal contraband, running with syndicates. I could say you're a threat to the Empire. <laughs> but I won't have to if you're smart. Oh, bribe. Do not, I love this. This is wicked. Thanks. But I'm smart enough to get myself out of trouble. You pay the tax just like everyone else. Whoa. Yeah, shoot her. Just relax. You won't make it off to Shara alive. Shoot. Maybe. Interesting. We have reports to the future. Oh, you're wanted. Talk about not messing about. Wanted me. So this is like... This is like... Like what? Three stars, four stars on GTA. Not the first time we've ever run the Empire. Escape the Empire, yes. There it is, top left corner. We've got like a little... um, Like stars, isn't it? Basically, wanted level. Looks like it goes up to what? Goes up to six, seven. If you include the center. Take off. All right, legging it. I think I would want a bit of a faster um, lift-off sequence than that. I just want to get into a vehicle and go. Do you know what I mean? Well, that's pretty cool. That actually looks gorgeous. So, what's this buffering? Loading up a new level? Yeah. As long as this is not like No Man's Sky, we're good, aren't we? Yet. Anybody on the Dog fight. Tie fighters on us. Love it. Look at the graphics here, man. Look at the graphics. Oh my god. I'm gonna need to buy some kind of 90 inch TV for this. Look at the state. ND, get us out of here. Hyperdrive. Hyperdrive. Can you hear that? Listen to those sounds. Those sounds are amazing. Wanted level went up, didn't it? Look. It's going down. We're uh, disappearing. Was that wanted or visibility, do you think? I'm 
loving the sounds and the graphics. I don't see what people have got an issue with. This is beautiful. Hey. Got your new toy. So, where do we go next? Anywhere we want. A bit cheesy. But I'll take it. Okay, different environments. Look at that, man. Nice, nice. Nice. Beautiful. Okay. This is what I want to see. This. Star Wars Outlaws, coming 2024. Was that? Wow, that was a fast 10 minutes in my opinion. That was a very fast 10 minutes. Wow. Okay, that is amazing. Very impressed. I'm very impressed with that. That was beaut. I don't see what the issue is. Why are people not happy? All right, so it looks like people are not happy with the pricing. Okay, there's going to be different like versions and stuff, different editions of it, uh, bundles you can buy, packs you can buy and things like that. And it looks like that's why people are not happy with it from what I can tell. Also, there's something strange about like, even if you buy the physical copy you need to have online access to be able to install the game but that's standard that's normal that's nothing new whenever you buy a game nowadays you put it in and it wants to install things and that's from the internet like updates and stuff and if you haven't got online access then you're stuck so i don't really see what the big issue is with the physical copy thing Enlighten me in the comments if I'm missing something. I haven't looked too far into it. I think I'm going to be buying this game regardless of the obstacles it comes with because it looks amazing. At this point, at very least, it does look really good. I would be happy to like go for the full price on this as a gift to myself, as a one-off. You know, I wouldn't pay this kind of thing for you know usual games. It's this looks expensive. This hundred and twenty. Um, another thing that I would recommend doing, unfortunately, is holding out a little bit. Hold out a little bit, make sure it's good, um, make sure it's not one of those really buggy games which is always crashing and stuff. Make sure it's not one of those before you look to make your purchase. Um, so I'd play it safe with that. What was that game that came out? Cyberpunk. So make sure it's not another cyberpunk, you know, which had loads of issues when it first came out. You're going to want to hang back a little bit and just see what people are saying. Um, try to avoid spoilers where you can. Go for perhaps like text articles where they're just talking about it and talking about its quality and bugs and stuff. As opposed to watching videos um, if you care about spoilers and stuff like that. Um, I didn't go for cyberpunk because of its bugs and its issues. In the end, I never got it. And I really wanted that game. So with this one, I might just bite the bullet and just get it and just see what happens. Because I love sci-fi, I love Star Wars, and this is open world, so this should be amazing. Guys, Cyberpunk, is that fine now? Does that run perfectly now? Because I think I still want to try that game out, you know. Um, but yeah, looking at this, guys, um, for me, this looks amazing. Yes, I want it. I want to play all the parts of it, um, especially the parts where you see stormtroopers, nice, clean, beautiful looking, shiny cities and spaceships and, and all that stuff. Yeah, I like this rugged Jedi, you know, 
Jedi stuff as well, but I really like the the Sith First Order dark side dark side stuff. It just looks better, doesn't it? It's so it's so much so much more pleasing to the eye. But the textures in in these like Jedi looking worlds look really nice too. So uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Hit subscribe, hit like, hit share, and um, when I get this, I will look to be playing this online, and um, you guys can take a look, and uh, we'll stream it, and we'll go through it, and all that kind of stuff. For now, guys, thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one. See you later.